Hello everyone, this is Barb with Mystic Door Tarot and thank you so much for joining me. Tarot deck for the month of May is the Light Sears Tarot Card Deck. So this is your daily tarot reading for Sunday, May 7, 2023. Today we have the Eight of Wands. Well, certainly one of my favorites. So yesterday we had the Major Arcana card, the Tower, possibly bringing in something quite unexpected. But today we have the Eight of Wands, which generally is an energy that comes in so quickly, so rapidly, it can change things in a moment's notice. Eight of Wands is generally new good news coming in. This actually could be something that's coming in very quickly in regards to the energy yesterday with the tower coming in, with a positive solution or resolving the previous day's energy. Definitely an energy of speed, velocity, momentum. It's a very inspirational type of energy. It's very fiery, it's positive, and it is coming in now. So today, if you have a gut feeling that needs to be acted upon right now, be sure to listen to it. Now, a bit of a warning with the Eight of Wands, with all this movement. Avoid being swept along by this unpredictable energy, by having clarity about your desires and direction. But it is certainly wonderful to harness this beautiful window of swift opportunity. This is stepping into the flow of this energy and meeting your desires head on. Now, the one thing that I always like to talk about with the Eight of Wands is the direction of the wands, which can be different from deck to deck, changing the message entirely. Some of the wands are coming down. Some of the wands are shooting off. Now, these wands are directing you strictly to the center. This force, this divine guidance is really at its best today. Some of you will absolutely be traveling this is a card of setting things in motion. This could be rapid communication, very intense energy. And as I mentioned before, matters at hand will quickly be resolved and most likely in a very satisfactory way. Now, the warning again with the Eight of Wands is be careful what forces you set in motion. Because when this card turns up, it's nearly impossible to halt. And the best example I always like to mention is possibly gossip. Maybe not having all the facts or listening to gossip, it spreads quickly. You can't stop it. It's that kind of energy, but in a more positive way. Now, in regards to romance, this is a very passionate, exciting energy. This is kind of like love at first sight and being swept off your feet is what the Eight of Wands is in regards to pertaining to relationships, romance, and love. Eight of Wands can be in regards to if you're expecting a message. If there is a message you've been waiting for, it is now coming in quick. This is Sagittarius's card, an energy ruled by Mercury. So with Sagittarius, this can be a very adventurous yet unpredictable, optimistic kind of energy coming in, very... Um, coming in very quickly and leaving in the same manner. Now, it is ruled by Mercury. So that's associated with communication, perception on things, possibly travel, possibly business. But the number eight numerology, this is a number of abundance, leadership, influence, this number represents honor, respect, rewards, power. Number eight usually is an indication to combine material and spiritual resources together. And when the number eight is put on its side, it represents infinity. It is associated with the strength card and the star card. Definitely could be something that you are hoping for and waiting for. Now the crystal that is specifically associated with the Eight of Wands is pyrite. And let me grab mine. I acquired a pretty big chunk of pyrite uh, down south in Arizona, Bisbee, as a matter of fact. Now, this crystal 
has a connection to the solar plexus chakra. It's used to increase strength, energy, willpower, and confidence. So this crystal works in combination with the energy from the Eight of Wands. It's known as a wonderful, abundant stone, encouraging wealth, prosperity, and success. Very powerful, protective crystal that creates like a shield against negative energy. So today, the Eight of Wands has the message of possibly having to travel very quickly, maybe coming up with solutions to an issue very quickly, finding out some news, most likely good news coming in today, which you'll be very happy about. So today can be another day of uncertainty, unpredictability, but with the Eight of Wands, most assuredly, very positive energy coming in today and at record speed. Thank you so much for joining me today. Please be sure to subscribe, help support my channel. Love and abundance. Until tomorrow.